Okay, this is actually a really personal question for me because for a long time, I sought my talents and it was hard to find. And here's what I'll say about it. Here's the short version, I guess. You learn things by doing them. If you're trying to figure out what your talents are, you will figure out if you try it and it works. Is the simplest way to put it. I don't want to overcomplicate that. So there are a lot of spiritual gifts and it's likely that you have more than one and it's important that you try all of them because that's how you learn whether or not you're good at it. If you think like, hey, maybe I'd be like really, really good at evangelism, but you never try to go out and talk to anybody, you're probably not very good at evangelism. Or if you are, you would never know unless you just got out there and did it. And if that's not something you're comfortable with or it's not something that you get a good response from, odds are that's not your talent. So when it comes to finding a plan for your life, just find the thing that gives you energy. Find something in your life that just makes you happy, that you just feel God's spirit resonate with you that when you feel like you're doing this thing this uplifts you it uplifts the people around you it brings energy and joy and life into your surroundings and odds are that's exactly what you're supposed to be doing so in, in coming up with a plan people like to step by step iron out every single detail of their life moving forward but I think more importantly than that is make sure that your sights are set on Jesus find your true north make sure he is your north star and wherever you're leading wherever that may take you that he is the center of your vision for your life and then no matter what you're doing, if Jesus is your focal point, if that's your direction, no matter what the activity is, God will use it for his glory because that's the direction that you're heading in. So do the thing that makes you happy. It's very simple. Find your passion and follow it. Make sure that Christ is at the center of your goals and he will bring wonderful things out of your life and make sure that your life yields much fruit and it will all be done for his glory. And if you're looking for a plan for your very immediate future, click some of these links right here on the left. Uh, you can also ask us more questions on social media by hashtagging it AskAnima, and we will answer Anima. Or ask your questions in the comments below, and we'll try and get to them as best we can. Thanks for watching, guys. You're just waiting there. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> just click the links.